this video we will start right work in the widget build okay so right in the widget build first and here we will have that list okay and in here widget and and in that you have that stake widget children okay is fine in here right after size we go to media query okay dot of contacts there we go now right after dot size semicolon that's fine okay now we will set the if condition okay and here the camera control as you guys can see not equal to no if it's not equal to no then in that case we will do something right in there we have that stake widget children just copy there from here and paste it down in here okay and then load a there we go and in there we will have that position okay as you guys can see in here First, we will set the top to zero. Right after the left to zero. Right after width, we will set it to size. We will check dot width. This one in here is going to be done first. Right after this width, set the height. Okay, size. We will go with the height and subtract with the 250 okay right after will be child okay and right in the child you will be the container okay and right in the container we will have again child okay and in there will be the camera controller okay value is fine dot is initialized okay right after in here now we will set if and then if aspect ratio okay there we go we will take this down from here and write in the expect ratio we will have that camera controller okay as you guys can see dot volume there we go dot aspect ratio okay is fine here put comma first and write down in here write in the child okay and then the child will be a camera video okay and in there camera control is fine now write in here else and then else we will have a empty container okay this fine and here comma and right in here semicolon okay scroll it down now right after this we will simply build the result so right in here let's take widget children there we go dot eight as you guys can see now we will take this down and there will be that position okay and right in the position first we will set the top and top set it to zero right after left set it to 0, 0 0.0 right after set the width and in width there will be a size I'll check dot width okay now height and height the size okay with the height subtract it to 250 that's fine in here right after it will be child and then child there will be a build result okay there we go all good in here the semicolon here now in here we will simply 
toggle between the front and back camera ok so for this in here again we will have have that stack which is children simply copy that from here to here copy it and write down in here just press it ok as you guys can see in here so this time we will change the top size I'll check height ok and subtract with the 250 there's the top ok right after I'll have to be 0 ok that's fine in here now it is fine and height will be just 250 ok now we will remove that from here and right in the child we will have the container ok right in here take this down first we will set the margin ok and in margin as usual add insect we will go the only ok set the bottom to 80 ok Right after this child and the child will be a column widget and in column we will set some properties when axis alignment ok we will set it to center ok and right after close axis alignment in here we will set it to center ok there is fine in here will be children and right in the children will be an icon button ok take this down adding the on press first we will remove that from here ok we will simply call upon the function the toggle one ok that we created before there we go, toggle camera to front or back, ok, just hold upon that in here now add in the icon, we will remove that, ok and then we will write icon and there will be icons and there dot we will go with the cage, ok it's fine in here you can also choose the cache outline, rounded wood and sharp it's all similar I think we will go with the cache, ok, it's fine now we will set the color for it, ok close we will go with the white one that's fine put comb in here so right after this we will set the icon size we will set it to 50 and right after we will set the color colors we will go with the black one this time ok and that's all ok good now add in here we will remove that container and in here we will have scaffold ok and right in the scaffold as visual body ok the body will be container set the margin first ok set the spelling for the container in here that's fine margin now ok there we go as insect as usual we will set the top to zero ok now right after this set the color and then colors we will go the colors to black ok right after child and then child will be in that state ok and mistake there with the children and children will remove that and you will have that stick with your children okay there we go okay and there's all the code okay for the home dot dot now we will do the last thing 
is simply we will go with the Android right in here, open it, right, open the app and open that build or gradle right in here. We will change that SDK version to 21. Okay, it's fine in here. Close that. And now at the top, we will just simply copy that name from here. Perform detection on a stream frame. Just copy that. And right in here is working true. Right after in here is called upon that. Okay. And in there there will be a image from stream. Okay. Let's call upon that in here. All good. Now we can simply go and run the application. Okay. So we will simply open the terminal. I will press this flutter run no sound no safety okay as we did in the previous application okay because the firebase ammo vision didn't support the no safety so in that case we will write that flutter run no sound no safety and then we will press enter this will take some time just wait for a while can see okay so there we go with the front camera as you guys can see my hand you can also test it with the front camera or you can go back to the big camera just tap in here okay there we go as you guys can see now we will open the google pool okay just to test the face detection okay now we will move this to the left side ok and zoom in as you guys can see in here it's working totally fine with the fast detection ok there we go now we will check it with another this one let's see It's working totally fine, okay. And that's it for this project.